Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here and into 3D printing, photography, drones, tech and whatever interests me, start now by subscribing and hitting the bell so you won't miss anything. We're talking about a laser engraver today, we're talking about a compact laser engraver which is at the same time smart and powerful. I'm talking about the Laser Picker LP2. It's compact as I said and it's amazing. Let's roll the intro and let's talk about it. with the unboxing unboxing was a really really great experience beautiful packaging everything is well built mostly anodized aluminium and feels premium setup deadly simple I connected two wires snapped on the stand and was ready to go if you're a beginner you love how quick it is I was engraving my first project in under 15 minutes and then included stopping to film so this is not your average laser engraver. You can control this laser by using an app from uh, Laser Pecker. And uh, this app is what really sets this apart from a lot of other diode lasers. From your phone, you can import images, use presets, design, type in text, or even sketch something freehand. It connects via Bluetooth, and within second, you can go from ideas to execution. You select the material, you get all the options that you have. You don't get into deep, like for example, uh, light burn. I mean, you don't have that feature, but the app really does its job. Let's have a look on how we can uh, really fast engrave something. The main difference between this laser and the other lasers that I've uh, reviewed in the past is that it doesn't have uh, axis and it doesn't move. So it's fixed on a 10 by 10 centimeters and the, la the laser doesn't move and engrave vertically but engraves diagonally. That means it covers the area of 10 by 10 centimeters and that also means that you have a very very fast laser engraver let's talk about performances i tested this on birch plywood mdf cork leather stoned and even painted glass some materials took a bit of tweaking especially for photo styles image but overall results were solid logos and text clean and sharp Something amazing about this uh, uh, portable laser is the fact that you can take it with. I mean, you can detach it from the base. I mean, I don't have it, but it comes with that with a battery pack. I have to be connected to the to the to the power. But with this one, you can even go and engrave on on wood outside. And that's something I have in plan of, of doing as soon as the battery pack will arrive. I've ordered it and it's gonna come really soon. But that's something more that you can do and you cannot do with a regular laser. Something, another feature that I loved is that it come with this roller board. The roller board basically can do two things. The first one is make you, allowing you, to engrave on, I don't know, uh, water bottles or uh, uh, pans and uh, whatever is round. And on a glass, I tried to engrave on a glass. Uh, of course, I needed a little bit of tweaking. I painted it with a, with a brown pencil on and engraved on top and then cleaned it with isopropyl alcohol. 
the 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 design stayed there i tried to do my logo i did it first i inverted the direction but anyway it works i also engraved um an aluminium bottle like water bottle and the results you can see are amazing but not only that you can also extend the engraving area by transforming this roller platform into basically wheels for your laser engraver and so the 10 by 10 can be 10 by infinite i mean if you have a battery you can go on for long i'm constrained by the cable so my the only example i can give you is this one so let's dive into some of the prints as i already mentioned this is a, an aluminium id card that i engraved and as you can see qr code and engraving came out brilliantly i mean this is this is a, a test i always do with my lasers i take i try to understand how long it takes to do this both sides and with a regular laser this takes usually 10 or 15 minutes with the helpaker lp2 it took like three minutes for one side and two minutes for the other side so that's the convenience of having a fixed laser that goes even if if the area is small it's like fast really fast compared to the other ones and at the same time power is not diminishing i mean this is a piece of metal that was sent with the with the laser and as you can see it did its job and it did it brilliantly brilliantly something else i would like to show you is this spatula i always do spatula test the spatula came out marvelously i don't want to get uh, into detail and explain how to focus uh, uh, the um, the laser I mean it's like pretty easy if this is put on this is uh, the the point that has to lean on the object it comes with this beautiful like uh, cover and uh, X like like uh, uh, laser protector like for your eyes and at the same time some kind of ventilation I must say I didn't see a lot of smoke while engraving even though I was late I was engraving uh, plywood and uh, starchwood as you can see it's like pretty detailed that's a laser pickle logo this is a UN logo that I engraved and uh, I'm gonna show you something else hold on as I was telling you before this is a, a bottle that I had and I wanted to engrave my logo and as you can see, it looks professional. I mean, it looks like somebody uh, created this and then sold it. I mean, looks my logo look really professional. So I'm pretty stoked with this laser. And um, I think it will become my desktop laser, laser for... Uh, uh, for good now because I mean I'm using it a lot I'm, I'm, I'm really literally forgetting what I'm using it for because it came it became part of my daily routine okay we talked about all the beautiful things it's a great laser I mean you can feel the quality in it it's heavy I've reviewed laser engravers that weigh less than my mobile phone but on this one you can feel the quality it's sturdy it's heavy and this reflects also the engraves and the cuts that i've done talking about drawbacks drawbacks the only two drawbacks i can see is the fact that it doesn't talk to light burn or any other software on the computer you can i on a mac i was able to download laser picker app for mac it worked and i connected through that and it went perfectly i actually used bluetooth from my Mac to this and it worked fine but connecting that to Lightburn and all the functionality of Lightburn would have been something perfect I know you cannot ask for everything second drawback which is probably the main concern is price if we consider the material which is built it's not a lot 
if you consider what's on the market for a very low price, I mean, of course, as much as you pay is as much as you will have. If you pay 100 euros for a laser engraver, you will never have the quality that you have on this one. But there's often coupons. By the way, coupons will be down in the description for your reference if you're interested in buying this machine. But this machine is aimed for somebody who already has laser engravers. This will be standing on my desk. It's gonna be my go-to uh, laser engraver. I did everything with this laser. I was so happy. And the fact that it's portable as soon as I receive the battery will make it even more powerful. So take your consideration. It's um, maybe not your first laser, but probably your second or third when you start using it a lot. That was all for today, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe if you're not yet subscribed. And I'll see you guys on the next video.